नित्यलीला प्रविष्टम विष्णुपाद अष्टोत्तर सतमा विभक्त वेदांत शिल महाराज एंड नित्यलीला प्रविष्टम विष्णुपाद अष्टोत्तर सतमाभक्ति वेदांत शिल नारायण गोस्वाई महाराज एंड सेवेंटी ऑफर माई हम्बल रेस्पेक्टफुल धन वर्ष को नाम लोटस पीठ ऑफ नित्य लक्षा भक्ति वेदांत स्वाई महाराज शिल गोविंद गोस्वाई महाराज शिला भक्ति रख श्रीधर गोस्वी महाराज शिल भक्ति प्रमोद पुरी गोस्वी महाराज एंड ऑल सीनियर डिवोटीज एंड ऑल विष्णु विष्णुवीज एंड प्रेजेंट माय रेस्पेक्टफुल Okay. <coughs> According to Vaishnav calendar, yesterday was the different day, this appearance day of Nitya-lila, Prasthan Vishnu Pada, Sridhar Satyam, Bhakti Vedanta, A Bhakti Arakha Sridhar Goswami Maharaj. So yesterday, we have short of time, lack of time for this regard, I did not glorify about his Life history and his contribution. So I want to speak few words about the glories of Nitya Prasanna Vishnu Pada Sri Tara Satya Bhakti Rakha Sridhar Goswami Maharaj. Actual in in our Gauri of Vaishnav society, he was the prominent Acharya, <coughs> so and he a, and our Gauri Vedanta Samiti is um, <coughs> established. Shri Bhakti Bhakti Ve Bhakti Shri Bhakti Pradhan Kesha Goswami Maharaj also took sannyas from him. So for this regard, in our Gauri Vedanta Samiti, all uh, <coughs> members they also indebted with Nitya Prasanna Vishnu Pad, Ashtoda Satyamana Bhakti Rakha Sridhar Goswami Maharaj. His, in his name also said in his sannas name Bhakti Rakhak Sridhar uh, Goswami. Sri means Simati Radhika, Dhar means she keep and hold in his heart. That means one who always holds the divine love of Simati Radhika in his inner court of heart. That is called Sri Dhara. Sri means Sarva Lakshmi Srimati Radhika. Dhar means hold. Rakshak means and always he and to protect the Krishna Prem, Radha Prem, in the heart of all the living entities.
because uh, when you read his granth then you realize how he was the great and elevated vishnuv and he always discussed the radha prem and specially he always absorbed with lord chaitanya mahaprabhu and without taking shelter lotus of lord chaitanya mahaprabhu no one attain highest divine highest divine love of shrimati radhika यथा यथा गौर पदार बिंदे बिंदे भुवाद कृतपुण्य पुंजा तथा तथा सब हृदय अकस्मा राधा पदाबुज सुधंबुराशि एन वर् शास्त्र वेरी क्लियरली एक्सप्लेन दिस वे वन हू कंप्लीटली एब्सोल्युटली सरेंडर लोटस वर्ल्ड लॉर्ड चैतन्य महाप्रभु एंड ऑटोमेटिकली राधा प्रेम विल मैनिफेस्ट इन हिज हार्ट and specially in this kali yuga without taking shelter lotus feet lord chaitanya mahaprabhu no one can attain in highest prem of different color radha and krishna गौर प्रेम रसार नवी शीतरंगे जीवाडी श्री राधा माधव अंतरंग इन दिस बेंगोली संग वेरी क्लियरली एक्सप्लेन जीव गौर प्रेम रसार नवी वन हू कंप्लीटली एब्सुलटली मार्स इन दैट डिवाइन लव ऑफ श्रीमती ए कृष्ण चैतन्य महाप्रु एंड ही विल बी इजी टू एटेन ए डिवाइन लव ऑफ श्रीमती राधिका प्रभदानंद सरस्वती पाद ही ऑल्सो वेरी क्लियरली मेन्शन इन इज ग्रंथ आराधित आराधित नवन बृंदावनस्ते नाराधित नवन बृंदावन एव दूर आराधित दिजसुत ब्रज नागरस्ते नाराधित ब्रज नाराधित दिजसुत न तब ह कृष्ण आराधित नवन वन हु वर्चिव नवदीप धाम ही वि बी एटेन टू वृंदावन धाम or one who not worship navadip dham any method you can attain to vrindavan dham or one who worship sachinandan gaur hari and he can attain to krishna who is the beloved of the gopis or one who not worship sachinandan gaur hari any method you can attain to um, krishna who is the beloved of the gopis so there are many evidence one who completely surrender Lotus feet of Sachinandan Gaur Hari and absorbed with God Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's divine pastimes, he will be able to qualify to submerge in the conjugal mood of Vrindavan and divine couple Radha and Krishna. so in this way we see bhakti rakta sudhar goshrami maharaj he always absorbed with chaitanya mahaprabhu and always absorbed in the name of gaur sundar gaur gaur nam name
when I first came in Devananda Gaudiyamat, then there was no any sannyasis in Devananda Gaudiyamat. Mostly they were, were to preaching and to different different place. And so for this regard, every day I used to go to listen Hari Katha from and his temple. And then I uh, no yeah, in Bhakti Rakha Siddhar Goswami temple every day. That is Chaitanya Sarasad Gaudiyamat Navadiv Dham. And when I first met with him, I also saw how he was completely absorbed in Mars in the name of Gaurasandha. So for this reason, I was so much impressed. And, and I every day used to go and Chaitanya Sarasad Gaudimat and listen Harikatha from his lotus leaves. And he was very sweet and also love and affection to his all the um, living entities. He did not discriminate who is, uh, who is a disciple and he did. And there's so much love and affection with me. And he also gave me blessed. Uh, I have to do bhajan and sadhana. And he also kept his lotus hand on my head. And later, I also read his very nice, beautiful uh, books. Uh, that is called uh, Golden Volcano. This book and very nice, uh, this very nice, beautiful grantha glorified about Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's sweet pastimes. And why Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and Krishna took Simati Radhika's uh, golden complexion. Generally, all we know, if Krishna, he stole Simati Radhika's complexion, golden complexion and her mood. Radhika Bhav Kanti Churi Kari Krishna Avatirna Harila Navadiv Gauru Rupadhari. Krishna stole Simati Radhika's golden complexion and her mood and manifested in the form of Sajinandana Gauru Hari in Navadiv. But Srila, Srila Bhakti Rakhar Siddhar Goswami Maharaj, in this book very clearly explained, actually Krishna, he did not steal the complexion of Simati Radhika. Actual, this is these things he also told this katha and one Purana katha. The when Krishna he is coming from Guluk Vrindavan to in this 
चतुर्दीप धाम नवद्वीप धाम एंड टू प्रैक्टिस श्रीमती राधिका हाइस्ट मूड महाभाव एंड दैट टाइम श्रीमती राधिका से इज थिंकिंग हाउ पर्स माई बुलाविड कृष्ण विद प्रैक्टिस एंड माई दिस महाभाव बिकॉज दिस ओनली दिस महाभाव द एक्टिविटीज ऑफ महाभाव आई कैन टोलाइज कृष्ण कैन नॉट टोलाइज सो फॉर दिस रिगार्ड श्रीमती राधिका सी हर सेल्फ कम्प्लीटली वट इज कॉल्ड कवर द होल बॉडी ऑफ कृष्ण बिकॉज महाभा महाभाव स्वरूपिणी श्रीमती राधिका सी इज थिंकिंग ओनली आई कैन टॉलाइज द वर्ड द एक्शन ऑफ महाभाव बट माई बिलाभेड कृष्ण कैन नॉट टॉलाइज बिकॉज वेन महाभाव कमिंग दैट आई एम मेनी काइंड ऑफ स्टैसिक मूड मैनिफेस्ट so that types of uh, stasic manifest not possible to tolerate the body of krishna for this regard krishmati radhika she herself completely cover the whole body of krishna so for this regard krishna's body is called um, white complexion or golden complexion and that things also jib goshai path explain antar krishna bahir gaura Inside he is Krishna, outside Srimati Radhika. so now this conclusion is that and the siddhanta con- <coughs> the, con- the siddhanta is the consciousness of the scripture shrimati radhika and her complexion non different from herself then deha dehi vidanasti there are no difference in body and the complexion in this material our body and complexion and our atma and the soul and body different but in transcendental world their body and soul are same their complexion and their <coughs> body also same for this regard shrimati radhika she completely cover the whole body of krishna so for this regard conclusion is that radha eh, are another ki radha krishna ekai swarup radha and krishna is one there are no difference radha and krishna सो फॉर दिस रिगार्ड राधा कृष्ण एक ही स्वरूप लीलाद्रस आसादी धरे दई रो
In the same way, our Rasika Charja, Srila Gurugandha Goswami Maharaj also mentioned in the <coughs> Krishna himself also took an uh, uh, Radhika's complexion uh, and covered in his body. Or Srimati Radhika herself also covered the whole the body of Krishna. <coughs> hmm. The Guru Gunda Goswami Maharaj in his Granth also explains once Radha and Krishna they were meeting one confidential place. Then suddenly Simati Radhika she asked to Krishna, You give me one benediction to me. And I at a time I can also relish your whole body. Then Krishna gave blessing and now Krishna he is coming from Golok Vrindavan to Navadhi Vidham. Then and Krishna took Simati Radhika's whole body and cover himself. So we, when you reconcile these things and all these years are perfect. So what Bhakti Rakha Siddhar Goswami Maharaj saying and what Srila Gurumadhu Goswami Maharaj saying, what Gurudev is saying, what the same is um, or equal. Complexion, Simati Radhika, Simati Radhika's complexion. So Krishna took Simati Radhika's complexion and covered his own whole body. Uh, so that means that the Simati Radhika covered whole body of Krishna and from, from his toenails to head, everything Simati Radhika covered. So at a time, Simati Radhika, she relished uh, Krishna's uh, whole body. Uh, another also Srimad Bhagavatam explained in this uh, in this Kali Yuga that incarnation is called Prachanna Avatar, that means hidden incarnation. So when we say in Srimad Bhagavatam, the Prachanna Avatar, Prachanna means hidden incarnation, that is Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. And so Ch Chaitanya Mahaprabhu he is Krishna and he himself proved in front of his very nearest devotee, Antaranga Bhakta. Uh, as like in front of Raya Ramananda uh, Mahaprabhu manifested his Rasaraj Mahabhav Sarup.
and and this Rasaraj Mahabhav Swarup, this Katha Krishna Das Kaviraj Goswami explained in Chaitanya Charitamritam and in Raya Ramanda Raya Ramananda Sangbad. The conversation between Raya Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and Raya Ramananda. So now coming in this way, so Bhakti Rakhar Siddhar Goswami Maharaj in his books very clearly explain the without taking shelter, Lotus Lord, Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, no one can attain the Gaur eh, the Braja Prema. And Lord, Lord Chaitanya Guru himself told, Ama bina braja prem nahi anne dite. Except me, no one can give braja prem. That means in the Kali Yuga, only Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu will give braja prem. So, if you want to know more about this philosophy, you have to read Bhakti Rakhashadar Goswami Maharaj this book, the Golden Volcano. This is very important goal. <laughs> English. Uh, they have, they, uh, uh, no problem. They can listen, this is enough. If the devotees listen, they can understand. If they read, maybe they can understand. Uh? <laughs> yeah. 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 Some of our Acharya's, Rasik Acharya's book always have to carry on yourself. As like Bhakti Rakhasudar Goswami Maharaj, the Vulcan, gold, the Golden Volcano, this book, Guru Gandhi Goswami Maharaj, Embarkment of Separation, and this book, Mothra Meets with Vrindavan, and this book, and so <coughs> they may you understand and about our Gurudev mood. Because our Gurudev mood is non different from Guru Gandhi Goswami mood and also non different from uh, Bhakti Rakhar Siddhar Goswami Maharaj mood and Shlok Bhakti Vedanta uh, Sai Maharaj mood and also Bhakti Pragan Kesar Goswami mood. All Acharya's mood may understand, read their books. Without reading books and listen their life history, no one can understand they, what uh, they are distributed in, in our Gaudiya uh, society. So now coming in this way, just just to introduce uh, uh, before speaking about his life history of <coughs> Bhakti Rakhar Siddhar Goswami Maharaj. Actually, Bhakti Rakhar Siddhar Goswami Maharaj, he was born in high class Brahman family and also educated, highly educated. And that time, he also uh, and in university law college and i think first um what is, first, part. Eh? first part first part he 
he completed then he came in mayapur and and he saw uh, the disciples of bhakti siddhanta saraswati prabhupad and he became very surprised how all the devotees of bhakti siddhanta prabhupad they are highly educate, educated and learned and scholar especially when he came in mayapur and so one white cloth brahmachari he was sitting and in his chair and his feet on the over the table and he closed his eyes and chanting holy names and and all the sanasin brahmacharis paid their obeisances his lotus feet and sometimes they also asked some question and he gave answer then he became very surprised why big big sanasis and brahmacharis red cloth they paid their obeisances this white cloth and sadhu and who closed his eyes and and that time they one person he told his name is called vinod vihari brahmachari that time param guru maharaj his name was vinod vihari brahmachari and he told he actual he was the manager of Uh, the bhakti uh, bhakti siddhanta sasri prabhupad mayapur state and he also listen hari katha from the lotus leaf of bhakti siddhanta sasri prabhupad and all his disciple then he became very so impressed and he surprised how all the disciples of bhakti siddhanta prabhupad they are learned and scholar uh, then he is thinking i am insignificant in front of all the disciples of bhakti siddhanta prabhupad so i have to re- return back to my home and complete my education then maybe i return back and do perform bhajan and sadhan in mayapur then later few uh, months or one year then param guru mahara bhakti pragan kesu gosan me vinod bihari brahmachari also went to his house and brought him again in mayapur and he took shelter lotus of bhakti siddhanta prabhupad and he was staying in the temple that time bhakti siddhanta prabhupad gave him brahmachari vesh and also later sannyas and and brahmachari his name ramanand ha mm-hmm. eh? ramanand das and then he also took sannyas then he bhakti rakhak and sridhar gosham bhakti rakhak sridhar gosham
because Bhakti Pragan Kesu Goswami Maharaj, that time the <coughs> Vinod Bihari Brahmachari, he was the manager uh, of the state of Mayapur. For this regard, he did not take saffron cloth and also he did not take sannas. And, uh, and, but later, Srila uh, <coughs> Bhakti Pragan Kesu Goswami Maharaj, the Vinod Bihari Brahmachari, he took sannas from Bhakti eh, Bhakti Siddhar Goswami Maharaj after the, after the departure of Bhakti Siddhar Goswami Prabhupada. Because Bhakti eh, <coughs> uh, Vinod Vihari Brahmachari, Bhakti Pragan Kesugoshai Maharaj, he noticed the, the Bhakti Raka Siddhar Goshai Maharaj, how he is very highly qualified person and always absorbed with Radha Prem. For this regard, he took sannas from him and in, uh, in Katwa and at that uh, time of what is called Sannas Day. Um, Vishwarup Khori Mahotsav. So in this way, we have so much deep uh, relationship with Nitya Lakshana Vishnu Pad, Ashtadeva Bhakti Siddhan, e Bhakti Rakha Siddhar Goswami Maharaj. Meant a, <coughs> so I saw his great personality and his bhajan and sadhan and and how he has love and affection with all the uh, devotees and especially and <coughs> after the departure of Mitravra Bhakti Vedanta Sai Maharaj then most of the devote his devotees took shelter lotus feet of uh, Bhakti Rakha Siddhar Goswami Maharaj. Uh, maybe, uh, sometimes they also uh, <laughs> speaking the quarreling, loving quarrel. So don't you look their loving quarrel. As like Advaita Ajaja Nityananda Prabhu's loving quarrel. So we should not to involve in their any loving quarrel. Our arise will be a uh, committed offense. Vaishnavir, Kriyamudra, Vigyana, Bujhai. And even those who are very learned scholars person, they cannot understand the activities of Vaishnavas. So, we should not uh, to justify Vaishnava's external activities. Uh, 
करें तो वैसे ये आवर लाभ एंड अफेक्शन विथ वैष्णव स्पेशली भक्ति रखो श्रीधर गोस्वामी महाराज एंड भक्तिवेदांत स्वामी महाराज एंड श्री लॉ गुरुदेव एंड ऑल आवर वैष्णव संप्रदाय एंड दे आर लाभ एंड अफेक्शन वी सी दे आर एंड लाभ एंड अफेक्शन एंड कोऑपरेशन टू ईच अदर Before I also told, the Bhaktar Kar Shridhar Goswami Maharaj, he was very learned and scholar, and, and he also wrote, uh, wrote many glorification of Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Prabhupada, especially Prabhupada's, um, what is it called, Tavak. Uh, Every day we are early in the morning and are uh, glorified. And, सुजनारबुदरादित पाद जुगम जुगधर्म धुरंधर पात्र बरम बरनागत वालित संद्र पदम प्रणमा सदा प्रभु पाद पदम एम तो रुकदेव एवरी डे अर्ली इन द मर्निंग इवीन ऑल ओवर गौरी ऑफ वैष्णव एम अर्ली इन द मर्निंग एम आफ्टर गुरुवास एम Gurvashtak, then everybody also glorified and uh, Prabhupada and uh, Prabhupada's Tavak, uh, 11th and Shrutis of Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Prabhupada. Actually, this is were very important and all these chanda, everything is were very and beautiful and attractive. And another, he also glorified Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, what is called Gaurav uh, Dham. That's why I forget. Um, Gaurav Dham, Gaur Gaur Dham and, and very nice, beautiful this also. And he also glorified about Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Without this mercy, Without the mercy of Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, we cannot attain the highest fame of Srimati Radhika. What is called Gaurav Dhamma? And <coughs> so, in this way, we see and all his granthas and specially he wrote many granthas in english bengali and in different different languages and because we, we we may understand when you read the uh, granthas books of vaishnavas they understand the what kinds of mood in in his uh, heart Gauradhamam. So, in this way, and again and again, we go down our forehead, lotus feet of and Bhaktar Kashyadhar Goswami Maharaj, and, and he will give sprinkle of. Uh, mercy upon us, then one day we will realize and uh, his heart and his bhajan and sadhan and then we enter in our spiritual life.
oke okay. so okay. so I will not take too much time now to this book okay. maybe another time I will give another Harikata okay. yeah thank you for your kindness okay. you find out this one Gaura Dhamma okay okay thank you uh, all you all Hare Krishna yeah my heartly blessing to you jai <laughs> jai all uh, all devotees my heartly blessing to you uh, good nice okay <laughs> how you how is your health good Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Yeah, in the they are always they are always preaching. Huh? Um, yeah. Preaching more. Uh, they are they are uh, they also open more hundred one hundred and eight center all over the China. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, all your long life eh, and preach all over the China. Eh? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh. Uh. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. Are you all? Okay. Okay, what is it? Yeah, okay, what is your name? Vivo? She is there? Or? Okay. Yeah, yeah, all you 